Welcome back to another episode of FoodRx by The Healthy Family Project. FoodRx is here to provide you and your family information to make healthier choices together. I'm your host, Julie Harrington. I'm a registered dietitian and chef. And this is a special episode today because we are sponsored by U.S. Cranberries. U.S. Cranberries provides the latest nutrition research about cranberries, resources, and delicious recipes. Cranberries have been studied for decades for their role in urinary tract health. In fact, in 2020, the FDA announced a qualified health claim about cranberry juice stating, consuming one serving or an eight ounce glass each day of cranberry juice beverage containing 27% cranberry juice may help reduce the risk of recurrent urinary tract infections, also known as UTIs, in healthy women. The FDA has concluded that scientific evidence supporting this claim is limited and inconsistent. Beyond urinary tract health, cranberry juice is being studied in relation to gut health. In a previous episode of FoodRx, we discussed all about gut health, and a recent gut study was completed supporting that regular consumption of cranberry juice when administered in certain amounts has the potential to assist in the management of H. pylori among participants in China where endemic infection and gastric cancer rates are high. More research is needed to determine broader effects of cranberry juice and H. pylori infection and additional details of the mechanisms of action. But anyway, we want to incorporate that America's superfruit, original superfruit, into our diet for not only urinary tract health, for gut health, for increased fiber, those antioxidants, but they taste delicious. So you can get cranberries as fresh cranberries, dried cranberries, or in the form of cranberry juice. And there are a lot of culinary techniques of how to include them into your daily diet. You can bake with them, you can add them into like this sandwich here. I have a chicken salad with some dried cranberries in there as well. You can make a cranberry sauce. The beauty of cranberries is they pair really well with sweet and savory. They have this little extra bit of tartness that really balance out sweet flavors, especially when you're baking with cranberries. And now I have a new recipe to show you on how to make an orange cranberry spritzer as a refreshing beverage for the summer. It's a really simple recipe, but it looks fancy in your glass, so you can spruce your water intake up a little bit. So all I have here is I'm going to make a single serving today since it's just me, but you can always make a larger one in a pitcher. And one of my biggest tips is we do not want to water down our delicious beverage. So what I have here is this cute little ice cube tray that are little hearts that I just froze some cranberry juice last night and you can pop these out. So we're going to still infuse that cranberry flavor instead of just using ice cubes and we'll water down. Also, you can freeze fresh cranberries too, and they can act as your ice. I have my delicious cranberry juice right here. I'm going to add a little bit of that. And then I'm going to add in some orange slices. This is really 100% not needed here because we are going to be using an orange sparkling water, but I just like adding them in my glass because then you have a little extra infused orange here. So I'm just gonna do pieces like that you can break them down a little bit more, or you can leave the whole slices in a big pitcher. It looks very bright and vibrant. And all I have left is my orange seltzer or sparkling water, whatever you prefer. And it just jazzes it all up. I'm going to use my reusable straw, give it a little stir so everything is incorporated and mm delicious. Thanks again for joining in on another episode of FoodRx by The Healthy Family Project. A big thank you again to U.S. Cranberries for sponsoring this episode. For more recipes, tips, and resources, head over to healthyfamilyproject.com backslash FoodRx. See you next time.